this is Mrs. Lindig, and during these days where everyone is staying at home more, I thought you might enjoy learning some extra things in math you wouldn't normally learn at school. This is a method of where you can count to 99 on your fingers, and you can also add a lot of numbers uh, without having to use pen and paper. The way this works is this is your right hand, this is your left hand, and on the right hand, that the numbers um, one of all the ones are on these fingers and a five is on your thumb. And it will be more clear when I show you and demonstrate. Your left hand is um, has the, the tens and a 50. And here's what I mean by it. This is called chism bop. And to use it, it's, it's uh, kind of like typing. You put your, um, just your wrist on the table and you loosely keep your hands hovering above the table. And here is, for instance, how you would count. Starting with this finger, uh, your index finger, it's one, two, three, four. Notice the, the uh, fingers stay down because this represents four. This is not four. So it's one, two, three, four, five. So when you hit the five, all these fingers come up, six, seven, eight, nine. Then when you get ready to hit a 10, you press the 10 on this finger on the left. This hand completely comes up, and here's 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and here's 20. You see there's two 10s, and so that's 20. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and 30. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. And we'll go ahead and stop at that point. Notice that all my fingers are up in the air now except my thumb on the left hand, which represents a 50. So let's say that you would like to add some numbers. I would like to add uh, 13 plus 17. So I could count up to 13. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Or I could just know that a 10 and 3 is 13. Let's say I want to add 17. Well, 17 is 10 plus 7. So here's 10. And I, now I'm going to do 7 by counting uh, counting, but just using that pattern where my fingers go down and up as I've shown you. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So 13 plus 17 is 30, which you probably could do in your head. So let's try um, a series of numbers. And um, so for instance, let's try five which I know is right here, or I could have counted up to it, one, two, three, four, five, but I know this is five. Five plus 12, that's 10 and two. So, so far I've got 17. Five plus 12 plus 19, 19, and now here's tricky, 19, I could say is 20 minus one. So let's try that to make it quick. That would be two tens, which is 20, take away one. So my total running sum is now 36. 10, 10, 10, 5, 1, 36. Uh, let's say I'd like to add mm, 27 more. Okay, 27 more. Subtraction would be a little tricky, so I'm just going to go 27. 20, which is 10, and 10, and 7, one, two, three. When I lift it up, I put down one of these, four, five, six, seven. My final total for those four numbers is gonna be 63. Now, to get good at chism bop, uh, a good thing to do is to enjoy doing this pattern first. I'm now on 20. 30, 39, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 60. Just enjoy that pattern for a while. Um, it's really enjoyable. And then try adding a few digits. At first, you can just count the digits. So 5 plus 4 plus 9, 
uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, plus 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, plus 9, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. The total is 10 and 8, which is 18. Uh, there are a lot of reasons you can use this. One of the funnest ways I do this is when we are caught by a train, I really enjoy counting the cars, and I just put my hands on my lap, and I start doing the cars like this. Um, of course, you could do it mentally as well, but it's so easy to forget where you are, so I really enjoy that. So I encourage you to give that a try. You're welcome to um, email me if or um at mclindig at comcast.net if you have any questions. Um, I found this was really fun. It does take a while to master it. I did give a course that was, I think it was a two hour course a long time ago to adults who were interested in learning to do this. It was invented in the 1940s by a man in Korea um, whose son kind of um, actually improved the method. Uh, it is not meant to replace you know, regular edition, but it is just an enjoyable thing to do. And I hope you enjoy chisholm bopping.